I'm going to show you how to install this anti-sway cradle and strap kit on this Softride HD bike rack. This is a great upgrade for the Softride element rack as well as this HD rack. So this comes out of the box as two pieces. We've already installed the strap onto the anti-sway cradle and now we'll put the anti-sway cradle onto the modular block or the bike block of the bike rack. We'll start by removing the rack arm from the rack and then taking the blocks off individually one at a time. We'll set those aside. We'll also remove the spacers. And when we get to the block that we're going to install it on, in this case the third one, we'll take that block in the anti-sway cradle and we're going to put the round sections of the anti-sway cradle into the square one inch holes. Once we do that, there are notches down here that we're going to slide that into. Once they're in those grooves, the anti-sway cradle will hinge and turn in that manner. So, we can put this back onto the rack arm now. When we put these on, we want to orient the round curved section of the anti-sway cradle facing away from the center line of the bike rack. That way it interacts with the seat tube of the bicycle. Get our spacer back on there. Final block. This is ready to go back into the bicycle rack. If we were installing two, three, or four of these, we'd put them in alternating locations facing away from the center line of the rack and then in alternating positions on the other side so that each bike has its own anti-sway cradle for its seat tube. This provides a third point of contact to each bike, increasing the stability of the system. Thanks. To see more video content, visit softride.com video.